give this tender doc to the drafting and scheduling department, please. Uh, yes, yes, sir. Any instructions? Tell them we need to get the substructure right. We lost time and money on the last two projects because they didn't do their substructure research. Will do, sir. Hi, boys and girls. Best you get this right in the substructure. The boss has his eyes on you two. Yeah, right. Okay, let's see. Uh, the soil's not good and there's possible rock in places. Uh, it's a tight site. Could be trouble. Remember, the last time we got caught with slow form workers, and in the meantime the price of concrete and crane time went up. Not to mention the crane broke down for two days, and we couldn't strip or move the formwork, and the rain bogged us in nearly every second day. Guys, one thing I know is that the speed form disposable formwork system is fast, clean, and not affected by weather, cranes, or labour. You know, we never make money in the ground, only when we get out of it. Slow formwork is costly. Our substructure budget is $400,000 per day, so if we save five days over the 12 weeks, our formwork install is basically costing us nothing. Zip. Our competitor used speed form against us and we lost. You know, they set up the beams and poured the same day, with no stripping. Pile caps as well. Some cages were set up on the ground and dropped in. No way! Yep, saved heaps. Formwork has gone up 15%. Yep, we have to be the crystal ball readers to keep the boss off our backs. And the cost of waste and cleanup is ridiculous. So why don't you guys put the speed form system in the method and let our subbies price it? Still, it might pay for us to do it ourselves. Get us the brochure. Speedform. The system works. Work the system.